Lemon Cake Dessert Oasis. Me and Buddy gonna try this one out, right buddy? Bars? Okay, so about 20 minutes ago, Dr. Darren Schmidt just released a video that's all about the top, in, top four ingredients in crappy junk food. So how does this stack up? So the first ingredient, protein blend, milk protein, whey protein, prebiotic dairy, dietary tapioca, fiber. So actually in the top four, it's none of those things. All right, there's natural flavors though, guys. Anyways, all right, sunflower lecithin. All right, well, all right, buddy, let's let's get you trying this first. All right. What? Yep, it's still an interesting looking bar and stuff. Whoa. Wanna try it? Whoa. Whoa. Uh, yeah, eat it. He just grabbed it and walk, walked away. So I don't know if we're gonna get an answer from him if he likes it, but for a little bit. So I guess I'll keep reading the ingredients and stuff. Protein-wise, it's got some decent lemon smell to it. I'd hope so. It's labeled a freaking lemon cake dessert oasis. White chocolate, palm oils, non-fat milk, sunflower lecithin, vanilla, coconut oil, flaxseed, Vegetable glycerin, coconut flour, tapioca, zinc gluconate. 4.5 grams of fat, saturated fat, which your body's pretty much made of saturated fat, so if you want to try and say saturated fat's bad for you, figure that one out. Total carbs, 23 grams, 11 grams of fiber. So it's pretty high fiber. Um, that makes the net carbs 12, which is you subtract fiber from total carbs. But also other people suge suggest you subtract the overall uh, alcohol sugars, which there's none in here. And as far as total sugars, it only says 6 grams, so that's pretty good. And the new Nutrition Facts label is supposed to tell you when it has added sugars. So, I don't know, this doesn't necessarily look like the new label... But maybe for bars, it doesn't have to go into more detail. I don't really understand or know or whatever. Um, comment below your favorite theory on what the pyramids are all about. Uh, let me know if you subscribe to Stargate Theory. Kosher, gluten-free, tasty enough to take home. Carry on. Wolo. So is it Wolo or wo no? So far, I haven't heard Buddy gag or anything, and I haven't heard him come back for more either, though. I don't know any other bars that look like that. White chocolate on top. Is it good, Buddy? Yeah. Yeah? You like it? Yeah. Yeah. Buddy likes it. It's like it's not exactly puffed rice. It always seems these have like some crunch to them that is very normal in all the protein bars. And I don't know what that is actually, but they're very normal. I don't see any chicory on here. That's interesting. All right, well, let's get Buddy over here and have him give his final opinion. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. All right, buddy, so is it a whoa low or whoa no? Which one do you think? You think it's a no? That's just his favorite word. He says no to everything. Do you want more? Maybe I should just ask, do you want more? Yeah, so I think it's a whoa low. Stay healthy, guys.